Hi, I'm Mark Benson with UAlbany Athletics. I sure wish we could be together in person to celebrate the class of 2020. During these unprecedented times, I know things seem to be tough. It's important, I think, to stay positive and stay focused. In UAlbany Athletics, we have a mission to help develop our student athletes to be great leaders, great champions, and great Danes. You're gonna hear from a few of our senior athletes as they talk about overcoming adversity and doing great things. To the class of 2020, congratulations and go great Danes. So Albany has shaped me in more ways than one. Line as a two-time America East champion. It's brought me this realization that I really am, you know, super capable of anything that I put my mind to. I, I really, actually, I know that I could have never ever done that any if I had started anywhere else. I think one of the biggest things that shaped me is my relationship with my teammates. A lot of people know the U Albany men's soccer team is very diverse. There's many different cultures on the team. So being able to kind of experience each different culture and learning how to get along and thrive and be successful with different people from different cultures that have basically different outlooks on life has not only changed my outlook and how I approach my life and how I approach my work and how I approach my practice and my playing and soccer related stuff, but it's to just improve me as a person. I think to be great, I think it's a culmination of a few things. Um, you know, a lot of people, um, you know, leave their mark on the, the football field or the basketball court. You know, the greats are the people who, you know, they dominate on the field, you know, they dominate in the classroom, they dominate, you know, in the community, help people out. Our team does do a lot of volunteering. Right now I am driving, um, volunteering to deliver for Meals on Wheels. It's like a tray like this in a bag that has a milk and a dessert in it, I think. It's such an easy thing and it makes them, they're obviously so grateful and it makes a huge difference in their lives. And more than just delivering them a meal, which is obviously necessary, like I offer two minutes, two or three minutes of just like socialization, like they get to see a person, which is nice for them. Being a great Dane is all about integrity and, you know, pursuing excellence, um, not only in athletics, but in life. I wrote a piece for the the conference's um, mental health initiative and making a difference with, you know, fighting against the stigma against mental health. And there's just so many ways that I think being great is more than just, you know, breaking records and, you know, winning titles. I think it's all about the character of your heart. <laughs> being great is, is being honest with yourself, learning from your failures and and striving, but I also think it's helping the people around you. There's a lot of um, um, unexpected adversity happening, but it's like, you know, what are you gonna do about it? Are you just gonna, you know, feel sorry for yourself? You know, just lay in bed all day? You know, you got all this time in the world, what are you gonna do? So I decided that I was making myself better and just um, grow as a person. Um, and the main thing that I did was I tried to grow spiritually. Obviously there's a lot of challenges right now, whether it be mentally or financially or everything in between. But, um, you know, as an athlete, we were taught to never give up and find a way. So whether it's finding a way to pay your bills or find a way to make sure your mental health is in tip top shape, um, that's I think that's something we can all kind of figure out. I think that being positive, especially in a situation, is so, so crucial. Trust the weight, embrace the uncertainty, enjoy the beauty of becoming, because when nothing is certain, anything is possible.